if you're coding CSS and you have to come in here and you're doing your top 1M, bottom 1M, right 1M, left 1M, and you were wishing there was an easier way to do that, it's all the same value, it's kind of frustrating that you have to write it out four times to do something like that. Well, guess what? No longer. You can do it with just one line of CSS. Hello there, my friend and friends, and welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, I'm all about removing the frustration of CSS. You can start embracing the cascade and just having some fun with it. And I know for me, every time I was writing top, bottom, left, right, and they're all, it, it just drives me nuts. There's so many values there. There's, I mean, there's four properties. It's not that many, I guess, but often they share the same value. And even when they don't, it just seems like sometimes there should be an easier way to do it. So let's go and dive in and see exactly what that is. So as I said, we have all four of these here. And instead of doing that, what we can do if you have them all the same is use the inset property. And this is a newer property. Do be careful with it. Browser support is far from 100%, but it is now getting, it's, it's getting there. So I'll put a link to can I use down below so uh, you can keep track of where it is while you're using it and you can make the decision if it's safe to use in your projects or not. Um, so here I can replace all that with just an inset of 1M. And just to show you that it's actually working, I can say 2M and you can see that it's going to suck in that pseudo element right there. Or I could go the other way and we can do like a negative 4M and that means it's going to actually be bigger. Isn't that just cool and fun? <laughs> so you can go in all those directions and now you're probably asking, is this a shorthand, Kevin? Well, let's find out. What if I do a 1M, 2M, 3M, 4M? What's gonna happen? It worked. It's a shorthand, just like border is short for border left, border right, border top, border. This is just so great, right? <laughs> and I know some of you are also asking, does this work for other things than position absolute? So let's go and find out. Let's make my body actually have a height of 200 VH. So we have a little bit of scrolling going on. And what if I came on to here and I changed this to a position of fixed? What's going to happen to my card before? Well, look at that. It's fixed and it has those same offsets. And what if I came in and I did a 50%? Well, it's going to work just like that. So you can see that uh, this is not only working with position absolute. This works for any time you want to use top, bottom, left, or right. And if you like this video and you like this short style of video where I just show you one thing really quickly and you can go on from there, I've put a custom playlist together for you right here of some of my favorite short videos that I've done. So if that sounds good, dive into those. And with that, a really big thank you to my supporters of Awesome, Zach and Randy over on Patreon, as well as all my other patrons for their monthly support. You guys are the absolute best. And of course, until next time, don't forget to make your corner internet just a little bit more awesome.